Hello everyone, my name is Ramon Gallego. I'm the founder and CEO of Face International Magazine. And I am Laura Claros, COO of Face International Magazine. And this is Face Goes to LA featuring preview models. Josh Weinstein is the CEO of Preview Models. He also happens to be a longtime friend of ours and gave us the wonderful opportunity to be a part of his March 22 production and featuring some of his models in our new edition. All the models we had the pleasure of working with had the same goal. The most interesting part was learning about their stories and their backgrounds and how they got there. Hey, so ever since I was younger, my mom used to take me to the mall. I always had a passion for clothing. I thought I wanted to start designing my own clothes. Then I realized whenever I was wearing the clothes I designed, everyone complimented the way I looked in it. I just decided maybe it's time I could start modeling. It's something I've always had a passion for, thanks to my mom always being a supportive figure for me. And that's just what it came to. My story is pretty simple, man. Um, I just started trying to truly discover myself. And uh, for that reason, I started getting into modeling. It's artistry and it's like finding yourself all at the same time. You're in front of the camera and you're raw and exposed. So who are you really in those moments? I moved to San Diego when I was 11 years old. And a few years later, my mom really wanted to get me into modeling. So we went and got some photo shoots done and put my portfolio out there. Well, I always grew up as a class clown, um, so I felt like the entertainment industry would be something that I would exceed in. Um, growing up, I did a few runway fashion shows, and now I'm here, giving it a shot. Ever since I was younger, I've always wanted to be a model, but I never really had the confidence or the nerve to actually go for it. So about maybe a year and a half ago, I decided just to go for it and just see what happens, and I love it. Well, I started modeling about six months ago, working with photographers who are trying to build a portfolio. I wanted to do preview models so I can help get my foot in the door into the modeling industry and so I can live my childhood dream. Uh, I started modeling because my mom's old boss actually said I should go to an open audition and we went to an open audition. I went to a big competition which was called IMTA and then I ended up signing with that agency that took me there and then I just kind of kept going from there. Hi, my name is Ariana Pedroso. I am seven years old and I'm from my walking on stage with a beautiful dress so everybody can see it. So I found preview models through Instagram ads and I have a background in dance so I was interested in trying something new and then just expanding into this industry. So my family really um, pursued me to like do modeling and just they just told me how small and skinny I was and I would just fit like the modeling industry so much especially with the photography. So I just did some, some research and I just started learning a little bit tips of the modeling industry and I started networking and I met some photographers and from there that's just how I started. I really just started with the posing, got more comfortable with the camera because that's really what it is, is just getting comfortable with the camera. So that was pretty much it and here I am in Hollywood. I started modeling about 2005 just for fun and I started getting serious about my modeling career about three years ago. Um, I started modeling actively about a year ago. Um, I found out about preview models through Instagram. I was scrolling and I saw their ad and I decided to check it out. Um, before I did check out preview models, I did a little bit of modeling for Hot Swimwear on Instagram and that's how my modeling journey began. I started modeling when I was eight years old. I told my mom at a very young age that that was something that I wanted to do. I started out with Disney Channel. I went to their auditions back to back to back. And over the years, I've also participated in Plano Fashion Week, um, let's, to name a few, uh, Passport to Discovery, and the ninth annual Barbizon competition, if anybody's familiar. I start modeling, it was in high school. My mom always say, you know, how you look, your body shape, and she's like, you should model. And I'm like, I don't really know if that, you know, model industry is for me, but I know it was for a reason. She said that, and now I just want to follow my dream and come to that industry, and I'm ready for it. So my story really begins from very young. It's something that I've always wanted to pursue being a model, but never really had the courage to really do so, just because the industry, you know, Obviously, people want to be a certain height or you have to be skinny enough to do so. But 
I love that we're in a world and a time where, you know, that's changing. People really want to see something more authentic. They want to see someone who they can reflect and really relate to. So I'm 28 and finally pursuing that. I mean, here I am with Preview Models. Their open call is really the first step for me even being here. We all have a story. I believe that that story really, um, really comes into perspective to a lot of people who you can encourage along the way. So I just generally want to be here to let, let people know that if I can do it, anybody can. With the whole modeling standard, you have to be six foot and, you know, six feet. Skinny. Skinny and, and yeah, and like certain shape and, you know, it was different. Like, I'm just glad that the modeling industry has changed now, you know, because now, like, we have curvy models, we have skinny models, we have petite models, we have short models. We have just a mixture of everything and that's what FACE is basically all about, the diversity and the inclusivity. So, we felt like if us creating something where models could have that extra support system, that extra push, you know? And I feel like when we started out, we didn't really have that model support system. I can't say just we didn't have that support system because we had our parents there every step of the way, you know? But um, just in general, I wish I would have had like more model friends, like more model mentors. And, and so I, I feel like the reason why we created FACE is to basically be that mentor, that model mentor for these models that are just starting out and trying to reach their goals. In addition to the Preview Models team helping them achieve their goals, we are just uh, another push that they need. Yeah, a form of exposure. So I started with Premier Models back in 2017. I went to their casting in October. I still remember the day. Um, my mom was like, oh my, you should you know, join modeling because I, again, I was like this weird looking girl and I wanted to do modeling, but I just didn't have the confidence to pursue modeling. And I feel like the whole production just helped me a lot with like my self-esteem, my confidence, my like feeling like I'm worth something, you know, I really felt like, wow, like I could really do this if I really kept trying. And I feel like if it wasn't for preview models, I probably would still be very quiet and I wouldn't be probably filming this right now on camera. And I'd probably- We wouldn't just, have met. We wouldn't have met, yeah. <laughs> I just feel like I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing now, so. I joined preview models in December of 2017, like right before Christmas. And I did their May 2018 production. Um, I've always heard from people like, oh, you, you look handsome, you should do this, you should do that. And I never really just did it until I went to the casting, received my call back, and went with the production in May, right after school, it was like over. And ever since then, I was always in front of the camera. I was collaborating with stylists, um, designers, some designers that were in LA at the show who styled me. Uh, reached out to me like hey like I would love to have you in my next catalog on my website whatever it was and I really think that preview models gave me the push that I needed uh, to get off of the I would say the ground um, I received two callbacks after my show um, neither of which actually went through but hearing the positive feedback from all the agents who are actually at the show and are from top agencies in LA and New York really just like did something. Yeah, so I actually did the show twice. I did it in March of 2018 and then I went back in October of 2019 and I was actually featured in Top Model Magazine. Um, and I feel like just being featured in the magazine was really like, again, the push I needed in order to get my foot really into the door and be like, okay, I got this. Like, let me keep reaching out to these designers and you know, these catalogs and see how far can I go. And I'm so happy that I met my best friend and my business partner and we created Face International. And I feel like without Preview Models, we would never have met. I mean, we would never <laughs> created Face at all. So my experience with Preview Models so far has been amazing. Um, it's been three days and I've got to work with so many great people, meet so many new friends, and I just got an experience unlike other. I think it's a big opportunity for anyone and I've just, came so far that it's amazing to me. 
So far it's been great, man. You get to meet a whole lot of nice people. You're in an environment where you get to showcase yourself and show everyone who you really are and that's all you can ever ask for whenever you do anything is for people to truly see you. So it's been fun. My experience with Preview Models has been great lately. They've been super helpful and guided me through this pretty well and I'm super excited. Here with Preview Models, it's been a great experience. I've learned a lot in just the short couple of days I've been here and I can't wait to see where this career could take me. I did my first um, show with Preview Models in June of last year and it went amazing and they asked me to come back again so I didn't have to audition. So I'm excited to be back with them and I love all of them. They're all just a great team and um, they just give me a great experience. My experience with Preview Models has been really fun. Everyone's really inviting and everyone's just here for a good time and that's what I'm here for. So. My favorite thing so far with Preview Models is definitely the people that you meet and how organized it is, because most shows that a lot of people go to, it's just chaos, you know, like nothing's really in place, nothing's really controlled. But with Preview Models, it's a lot different. Everything's set in order and everybody knows what they're doing because it's such a great company and a great show. My favorite about Preview Models is to make new friends. So from Preview Models, I really love that it's a hands-on experience meeting with the designers and then walking on the runway. And my favorite part was definitely the energy from the crowd during the show. So my experience with Preview Models was so amazing, y'all. I loved every bit of it. Social, uh, social networking with everybody, meeting new friends, especially with the face magazine was like one of the best um, experience I got to do. I would say the fashion show was probably like the best part of it. Um, I was so ready for the, like the runway walk and just the camera, so I just loved the whole experience. My experience with Preview Models has been everything amazing. I cannot describe the feeling that it's given me, the opportunity, the doors that it's opened. It's been amazing. My experience with Preview Models has been nothing short of amazing. I mean, the mentorship, the network, the friendships that we have been able to build throughout this has been honestly unmanageable. Uh, Josh has been amazing. Uh, Laura, the uh, acting coaches, yourself as well, even to have this opportunity to be here. Honestly, the biggest blessing that I could even, I, I can't even thank y'all enough for this. It's been, it's been amazing. <laughs> uh, my experience with Preview Models is nothing that I've ever experienced before. I was on cloud nine the whole entire time. Um, but it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of new experiences and things that I got to, you know, be a part of. So I'm really grateful for the opportunity. I had an amazing experience with Preview Models. The venue, the prepping, everything was amazing. Timed out, everything was completely organized. I had the best time. It was great. That experience was great. It changed my life. I always want to dream to come with a stage and a modeling and preview model put me out there and I'm just ready for it. May 2022. Oh. <laughs> oh my, God, so oh my, oh my, my name is Ijan James. Cora Wilson. My name is Alejandro Pascual. Omar Hayden Hilliard. I'm Baby. My name is Kimberly. Lee. This is Ariana Pedroso. I'm Chris Dewey. I'm Tiffany Garcia. Thread Helen Zimbalvo. I'm Joby Clinton. I'm Destiny Model. Hi, my name is Laura, and I'm here with Face National Magazine featuring Preview Models. This has been Face Goes to LA featuring Preview Models Summer 2022. Bye! We're gonna be like, this is Face 2022. Back to LA, October 2022. Okay.